Hello there, this video will go over installing and introducing the app that we will be using to install and set up a Linux desktop on an Android. If you're interested in Linux on an Android, then you may be interested in my playlist that will cover how to install and set up a Linux desktop on an Android without rooting. Without further ado, we will go to the Play Store and search for Userland and then install the Userland app. I strongly recommend not updating the app once it is installed because it can break Linux. Once the app is finished installing, we can go ahead and open up Userland where we will see the three main screens listed in the bottom navigation bar. The apps screen is for installing Linux applications and for the purpose of this series, we will use it to install Debian. The session screen is for managing sessions and is where we will start and stop our Debian session. Lastly, we have the file system screen, which is for managing session files. In the top menu, there is a refresh button and three dot menu option. I recommend not clicking the refresh button in the apps screen because it can break Linux. The apps settings, wiki, and help can be accessed from the three dot menu. In settings, I recommend setting the default landing page from apps to sessions in order to avoid accidentally installing an app from the apps screen. Do note that the session screen will be blank because we haven't installed anything yet. The wiki will take you to Userland's GitHub page and the help will give you a summary of the Userland app as well as links to the GitHub page and Userland's official website. In the next video, we will go over installing Debian. If you enjoyed this video, then you may be interested in the companion book to this video, Linux on Android phones and tablets. Other than that, see you soon!